The city of Battle Creek paused its hiring process for its new diversity, equity, and inclusion officer position. The move is only temporary. News 8's David Horak explains why it's on hold. In fact, the assistant city manager told me this has nothing to do with the candidates. It has to do with the job description. We've got excellent candidates, but we want to make sure we make the right hire for the city. To the service, the police department does to the community. What community feedback for the two finalists were also positive from a meeting last month, but concerns lingered over how willing they were to have a meaningful physical presence in Battle Creek and what the actual role specifically entails. We recognize it's not a traditional nine to five. These people are going to have to engage not only internally with city staff, but with the community as a whole, and that could happen. You know, at night, it could happen on the weekends, you know, and what, what, what availability would the individual have to really be immersed in our community? Assistant City Manager Ted Deering says this prompted them to pause the hiring process to address those concerns. However, he emphasizes that this is temporary and the city is still committed to the cause. They've been pushing the city to add a DEI officer for a period of time as well, too. So I think they understand the pause right now, our stakeholders out in the community, and they understand that we want to get this hire right. And I think that they'll hold us accountable and we'll hold them accountable to, you know, to come into a solution that works for the community. Deering says the city is more than likely to pick up right where they left off with the two candidates rather than hitting the reset button entirely. It should happen in about mid-October. We're in Battle Creek. David Horak, News 8.